It was a battle for GSL supremacy on the girls' side tonight at LC. The undefeated and three-time defending state champion Tigers trying to fend off the also undefeated Mead Panthers. And the Tigers cheerleaders trying to get the fans pumped up for this one. Mead came out hot early. Heidi Lugo, pop goes the peanut. She hits from three. Panthers take a four-point lead, but the Tigers bite right back. Daisy Burke throwing three-pointers. She had nine points. It's a one-point game. The Panthers would give LC all they could handle. Elisa Baird, she also shows off her long-range game. That's good from three. Back to the champs. Former Shining Star Sarah Cleaver getting down and boogie with it. She had 14 points. Meade put up a fight. But in the end, LC was too much as they win it by 13 points. As for some other scores around the league, Shadow Park knocks off East Valley by 13. The Highlanders improved to 6-2 and two with the win. And Central Valley beats U High by 13 as well. That must be the lucky number of the night. Also, Mount Spokane, 15-point winners at home over North Central. And Gonzaga Prep bounces back from a blowout on Wednesday to beat Ferris on the road by 3. Over to the boys, this year's GSL favorite, Gonzaga Prep, taking on two-time defending state champ Ferris. This one was all bull pups early. Sean Fisher had 31 points in this one. He's good from three there. Then Ferris tries to answer Jason Bates from the top of the arc. Jeez! But the undefeated pups proven there for real. David Nelson continues our three-point extravaganza. And the bull pups improved to 8-0 and with that 32-point win. As for the rest, Shadow Park staying on the heels of the pups. They improved to 7-1 and with a 12-point win over East Valley. And Chaz Johnson scored 32 points for Mount Spokane, but they missed 11 free throws at North Central Escapes with a one-point win. I have a feeling that's what they'll be working on in practice. And Mead, 15-point winners at Lewis and Clark, while Central Valley beats U High by 8. For the